here I was. Oh my God, where are your legs? In my computing history class, and I hear about this old analog computer called a planimeter. So surveyors would use this, and they'd trace a shape. It was able to do some kind of cool calculus with dials because it wasn't digital, and it could display the area of any shape. I bought this mouse that kind of looks like a pen. Yep, there we go. Let's see if I can find all those pieces. If we look this chip up, what do we see? A data sheet. I went and I made a prototype. We can actually do some testing. I took whatever piece of paper was on my desk, draw some shapes. It actually worked pretty good. I was pretty satisfied with the results. Ooh. That's pretty good. I assembled all of the parts that I just bought into a spaghetti prototype. Here I had my initial design, which had a lot of problems. The hole was completely dark. Actually, that's a major problem. In a incredible feat of over-engineering, I ended up with my final SLS print, putting everything together. Please disregard this part of the video. I'm honestly embarrassed by it. <laughs> There it is. Let's see the bad boy in action. Now we're actually going to measure the area of Dobby stuck in a glue trap. 23.08, 23.346. I think we're successful here. And just like Isaac Newton intended for calculus to be used, we now know the area of Dobby in a glue trap.